Mike, what's it like for you guys to get Chris Clemens back and be a part of your rush group again? I think Chris Clemens is a, a missing piece from the organization. If you think about his tenacity, the way he plays the game, he's obviously one of the best pass rushers to play for, third best pass rushers to play for Seahawks in history, if you think about it. And, um, you know, he did everything possible. He was here, now he's back. And he's from the boy at that spot where he's just, he's always been good at the right end. I think what me and Cliff do together and adding Clem to it makes it even a better pass rush and you got Frank coming up and he's, he's growing to a great rusher and of course Jordan has always been Jordan and we just got to make sure he stays healthy because we get him into some of those pivotal points of the season he can really help us you know over get past those bumps that we need to get past. What do you think of these two rookies you brought in? Rookies? I don't really pay attention to rookies. <laughs> yeah because I feel like rookies don't have they don't even have any scars or any issues so it's like I just kind of walk past them and tell them to clean up stuff when I get a chance. <laughs> you I think Frank's going to be a uh, country million dollar player. When you, when you think about the way that the, the uh, money's going to NFL, his disability to the team rush, his ability to put it all together, he puts it together. I think he'd be the best pass rusher to come to Seahawks, and I think he'd be one of the best defense players in the NFL. I think he has, you know, most one of he's the most one of the most talented players I've ever seen. You know, he's very motivated. He has the right mindset. He just has to put it all together, and he does. I think he'd be a, he's gonna be an animal. He's already he's so he's already really good. He just has to keep figuring out and keep developing and taking that next step.